Hey guys, Gage Maverick with Gage TV Travel and Leisure, and, and we continue our coverage of the Escondido Valley wineries, and here we are at Forgotten Barrel, and I keep not remembering where it is. I don't know, maybe it'll come to me during the shoot. Let's see. Hi guys, Gage Maverick with Gage TV Travel and Leisure, and we continue our tour of the wineries of the Escondido Valley. Currently, we're standing right here at the Forgotten Barrel Winery, right here in the Escondido Valley. And as you can see, a bit of a rustic feel. Now what gives Forgotten Barrel its distinction among the Escondido Valley wineries is it's actually the oldest, if not the oldest, winery that managed to survive prohibition. So it's been around since the early 1920s. And as you can see, a bit of a rustic feel. Some of these machines were here back in the day that are now out here collecting dust. We're gonna go inside and take a look around and maybe even have a tasting or two. Join us, will ya? Here at Forgotten Barrel, this is uh, the Sparkling Rosé, I'm kind of a wuss when it comes to wines, and we're starting at the wuss level here for me, so I actually enjoy it, it's very, very tasty. Where do you grow your laundry? Yeah, so we just get the fruit. Yeah, so here we are at Forgotten Barrel, and we have arrived at the final tasting here, and I love it because it's called Area 5150. Now, if you don't know what 5150 is in the security world or the police world, the code is 5150. What that means is crazy person. We see a crazy person walking around. They called it 5150 because it is a crazy blend yes. of all of the different, and what are they? The, the uh... Um, Cabernet, Tempranillo, Barbera, Zinfandel, Senso, Syrah, and Carrion. Just a blend of a lot of stuff. And if you know me, you follow me, you love me, it's like me breaking the rules, really, on wine making, probably, right? Yes. And it becomes one of their most popular wines, as it turns out. Not only that, it happens to be one of the less expensive bottles. So if we were to leave here with this, only $22 a bottle here at Forgotten Barrel. So I'm a fan of 5150 for many reasons. Not the least of which, I'm kind of crazy myself. <laughs> we'll see you in a minute. <laughs>